Mourinho was sacked as Manchester United boss last month after a calamitous third season in charge. From the offset, the 55-year-old picked battles with senior players such as Paul Pogba and criticised the board's refusal to fund his year for a new centre-back. The mood around Carrington training ground became increasingly melancholy as poor results and negative football also made for a toxic atmosphere at Old Trafford. Everything came to a halt following the side's 3-1 loss to Liverpool last month, in which Mourinho's defensive tactics backfired and made a mockery of United, who were defensively hapless in front of their arch-rivals fans. Two days later executive vice chairman Ed Woodward decided wielded his gavel on the former Chelsea manager's time in charge, cutting short his contract by 18 months. It is believed that Mourinho pocketed around £15 million from the sacking and, according to the Times, is about to make a small addition to that when he appears on buying sports coverage of the Asian Cup today, as well as Arsenal vs Chelsea on Saturday. Part of the severance clause stipulates that Mourinho cannot discuss his exit from Old Trafford, which has had an effect on the pay package he will receive from the Qatar-based network. It is understood that Bind Sports, who employ former Sky Sports anchor pundit duel Richard Keyes and Andy Gray, will pay Mourinho £60,000 per game. The fee was reduced, given his contractual obligation to not discuss his recent sacking. Should the divisive manager decide to break the rules, United have expressed to him that club lawyers will be watching the broadcast to catch him in the act. In contrast to the five-figure sum Mourinho will land this week, he was paid over £1 million for his views during the World Cup by Russia today. Mourinho rejected less lucrative offers from BBC and ITV, but his willingness to appear on Vine Sports for a cut price fee is chiefly because he was already planning to be in the area on holiday.